Yeah, go for it. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, what's up guys? It's Andrew from Avia, and uh, man, I am so excited to tell you guys we've got our music video for Garden Green out now. It's finally out. It was a lot of work and uh, it's a really cool video. So uh, I just wanted to tell you a little bit about it, kind of a little bit of the background and uh, maybe get you pumped up to go watch it if you haven't seen it already. Uh, so for those of you who don't know me, um, I used to have a pretty bad problem with drinking and uh, so did, I don't want to say, I don't want to speak for him, but basically people in the band have had issues with alcohol in the past. Uh, I think, you know, in America, when you turn 21, you can't, you know, it's, it's illegal to drink before that. And then when you do drink, uh, when you finally are 21, there's this whole culture of, woo, let's go to a party and get f***ed up. Well, you know what? Um, that's dumb. That's really bad. You know, you look at other cultures or other, other uh, cultures, other societies, uh, like in Europe and stuff, where you can drink at a younger age. You know, they, they seem to, you know, maybe they drink, uh, you know, more frequently, but they drink less and they drink more responsibly. Uh, and, you know, alcohol is so bad <laughs> when you really think about it. Alcoholism runs in my family. Um, I don't want to talk for Justin. I don't know if it does in his family or not. Um, but, it, it, you know, anyway, we've, we've, had, we've had problems with substances in the past. And, uh, you know, that's why I had to quit drinking. So I was really passionate making this video with him. This was Justin's song, his idea. He wrote he wrote the lyrics. Uh, he came to me with this concept, and uh, it, was, it was it was really cool. You know, uh, Harrison actually wrote the our bass player. He wrote the actual song. But when we first when, when you first listen to it, it sounds like a system of a down song. And then uh, then we all reworked it and stuff like that, and it just kind of became what it is now and I think it's really cool everybody got to put their piece on it but we didn't stray too far away from Harrison's original song uh, so you know Fosh completely redid the drums uh, Harrison uh, really beefed up the bass parts uh, I had fun of course doing the leads and all that kind of stuff and then Justin I think really went ham on the lyrics and I, I'm really proud of it I think I love the guitar solo in it I'm really proud of that it's I mean that was probably one of the more challenging ones I've written um, I'm normally not too much of a shredder kind of guy, you know, um, so it was pretty cool, you know, I'm pretty proud of that one. Um, and I really connected with the material. We did a lot of stuff with like, you know, the car scenes and all that, it was all, half was green screen, half was real, uh, especially the scenes where he's closing his eyes, we tried our best not to do that on the actual highway, but, um, you know, it's cool. Uh, the scene with him going through the windshield, that was a lot of work, uh, but it was really cool. It's funny, um, uh, I'll throw up a picture here, but you can actually see, this is how we shot that. He's in the garage, uh, just in front of a green screen, looking like an idiot. So, uh, <laughs> man, you should uh, you should have seen me trying to convince him to do that. And the little thing he's on is actually like a little, I think it's like a little PA speaker or woofer or something. Um, or, you know, so it was really hard to get that done without him toppling over. You know, Justin's such a tall guy, but, um, but we did it. It was cool. DIY music video, 100%. Uh, we did have the guys from Flatbread Productions help us out. Really cool guys. Um, so go check them out. I think that they're just called Flatbread on YouTube. Um, I'll put a link down in the description if you want to go check them out. They make some pretty cool videos. Um, so thanks to them for helping us with the studio shoot. You know, they shot all that. They brought the lighting equipment. Um, so we're just, we're really grateful for them. With drinking and stuff in the past, I've had a lot of negative experiences and this is why I no longer drink um, and probably one of the most negative experiences was getting behind the wheel and then waking up in an ambulance um, and it was probably one of the most scary you know things not knowing how I really got there um, and it you know that night could have ended so many other ways and so kind of for the video I had this idea like hey let's get you behind the wheel you know um, not drunk, you know, actually drunk, but let's, let's, let's give a cautionary tale. Cause that's what Justin wrote. He wrote a cautionary tale about partying and there's some other stuff to it, but you know, I thought it would be cool. Like how would that night have gone if I didn't wake up in an ambulance? How would it have gone if uh, say I fell, well, I did fall asleep, but what if I fell asleep at the wrong time? 
So, uh, you know, that was my influence for it. Uh, you know, the guys in the band, they were really cool. They're like, hey, yeah, let's do that. You know, let, let's really knock, let's knock this thing out. Let's make a really cool video. Let's not get too dramatic and I can get a little too dramatic. So I was trying to have Justin do all sorts of stuff he's uncomfortable with. Do the, do a fry scream. <laughs> Cause that's the look I'm going for. <laughs> don't make me do this, bro. Don't, no, please. Can we just do vocal shots? Okay, we can do that. Can we please? Why would you want him to oh, scream? Why so you so scream? I just, I feel like it's too emotional. It's like too... But emotional. when it's done, you won't even see yourself. I'm not an actor, man. Um, but you know, it's cool. We, we did it. We knocked it out. Uh, you know, the music videos we've done, we, we do them DIY, you know, and that's how we're gonna do it probably until the end of time. <laughs> you know, that's the only way to do it. Like, screw pay paying someone thousands of dollars. Just make it yourself. There's so much technology out there. Our video, Huntington, was made with a cell phone. Um, and, and because it didn't look good, I just rocked it. I just made it look terrible. So check that video out too if you haven't seen it. Uh, Kick Awake, we did... Uh, Justin rented some gear from his school and we went out and shot that and I think that one looked great so that one came out pretty cool I think this one did too so uh, I'm really proud of it again if you guys haven't seen it go see it it's worth watching at least once and then let me know what you think so uh, so that's about it for that guys uh, I hope you enjoy uh, watching that I'll put a link up for it right here <laughs>